Good afternoon. I'm Katie Collette with your Wavy TV 10 headlines. The Hampton Roads Regional Jail needs 113 additional officers to comply with the findings of a Justice Department investigation. The Portsmouth Under Sheriff, Colonel Marvin Waters Jr., says the possible new hires would cost an additional $7 million. As we've reported, the two-year investigation by the Justice Department alleged conditions at the jail violate the Constitution and federal law. Our Andy Fox is working to learn more about the potential hires. Look for updates tonight on Wavy News 10 starting at 4. Administrators at Eastern Virginia Medical School in Norfolk say they will hold a news conference tomorrow to announce their findings after an investigation into the school yearbooks. The move comes after an offensive picture showing someone in blackface on the page of Governor Ralph Northam. Northam graduated from EVMS in 1984. He originally admitted to being in the photo but has since denied he was in the photo. Ten on your side will be there for tomorrow's news conference on campus at EVMS. Suffolk police are investigating a deadly shooting. Officers responded to Remington Park on Gentry Street around 4.30 this morning. They found a man dead from a gunshot wound. Police have not released any suspect information. Our Chris Horn is working to learn more about the investigation. You can look for updates tonight at 4 o'clock. And remember, you can find all of your headlines throughout the day on wavy.com. Our next newscast is at 4. Have a great day.